Hi, you look confused. Have you lost something? I'm looking for a book. Could you help me find it? Sure, I've got a few minutes. Thanks, I really appreciate it. The book is bright pink. You can't miss it. The title is bright pink or the color of the book is bright pink? Both. What's it about? I don't know. That's why I'm trying to find it. Hey, I found your book. You'll have to let me know if it's any good. Thanks, but let's keep this between you and me, just in case. <laughs> You're weird. What's weirder, me reading the book or someone writing it? Both. Ooh. Hey folks, it's Grimwit from Nat Evil. We're doing this again, some high school dreams. And uh, I'll be honest, I don't remember what I'm doing, Ooh. except that I'm uh, collecting, doing a lot of collecting Ooh. of magnets because I figured, fuck, I want magnets, why not? I need to get out of the school before the janitor comes and throws me out. It's been a week since I played this. I don't remember what's going on. Oh, more magnets. Oh. Magnets are going on. I don't like magnets. <laughs> um, hmm. I'm not entirely certain what you get from this particular quest, but uh, I know we need to see seagulls after this, because there's the dolphins, there's the sailboats. Hell, that's two things we got to see out of three right there. Also, these sailboats... So real, you guys. So real. Oh my god, I gotta see more of this real action. Alright. We can check our objectives and see that we collected one of the three things that we need to see. Seagulls are left. Mm-hmm. Check, check, and check. No, no idea what I'm getting with this. Oh, um, sure, Mr. Planter Guy. Is Benny the one who hid rotten tuna in Turnbull's car? No way. It was old trout. Wah, wah, wah. Is Benny the one who hid rotten trout in Trimble's car? Hey, gullible new girl. Trimble doesn't have a car. She drives a truck. Trucks are cars, bitch. That was Olivia's diary, if you don't remember. You there. One of your classmates has hidden my books. Find them and bring them to me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, the books or the student? Okay, textbooks. New quest. Still, still not sure what I'm what I'm doing here. Well, these textbooks are all in the school, so let's see what we can find. Never fear, your diary is here. Oh yeah, this. There you go, Olivia. Oh, you saved my life. I can't thank you enough. Really? How much is too much? Uh, let's see here. I'm trying to see if... Yep, there it is. It's, the diary quest is complete. Hopefully she'll be friends with me. And, uh... Oh, hey! Jeez, Mom. It's like you have no legs. Doodly -doo, doodly -doo, doodly -doo, doodly -doo. Hello, dear. What ah, can good. I do for you today? J Jesus, stop stop smiling at I'm me. I'm here to pick up an item. Of course, dear. Here you go. Thanks. Lovely to see you, dear. Please come again. Thanks. Don't eat me. See you later. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we we know about objectives, and yes, it's, it's another objective complete. Probably a message from mom that says, "Don't st still still don't know how much money I'm getting from this." Thank thanks, mom. Oh, uh, sure, it's for your sister. Yeah, I'll do it. Hey, what's going on? What's up, Reginald? What are you doing out of the back room? Hmm. Well, it's not like we haven't done this before, and I'm super prepared for it, too. 
Look at these shin guards. I'm here to pick up an item. Of course. It's just over there. Thanks. Have a nice day. I mean knee pads. Was that a fashion faux pas to mistake knee pads for shin guards? Hmm. Come back and check us out. Meanwhile, textbooks. There's an awful lot of textbooks around here. Five, in fact. I heard Benny is planning on moving everything out of room 101 and into the basketball court. That would be a switch. Trimble's class being interesting and basketball being boring. <laughs> Hi, here's the top you wanted. Thank you so much. Without it, I'd be top. Left. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> I hope, uh, I hope you dude doesn't shut me down for that half a second joke. Alright, let's see, what else is left? I'm kind of, I'm kind of struggling here, looking for things to do. At least there are always fridge magnets and, uh, textbooks to collect, I guess. Just take your picture here. By the way, this is a thing you can do. You can just take people's pictures. Cool, huh? And there we go. I'm not even doing this for Eugene. I'm just... Hey, Seth, great news. You found the meaning of life? Okay, good news. I found the vista. At least that's one mystery solved. Now lace up those boots and let's go. What? What? Why are we loading? What? I, uh... Would you like to go to the vista now? I... Uh... Kind of railroaded into a date here. Did, did not expect that. How much further? It's not the first time either. Uh, yeah, it's over there. Seems like this is taking longer than I thought. I don't know. I don't wear a watch. Mine broke. What's your excuse? I think the modern man is too concerned with clocks and schedules. Do teachers buy that excuse when you're late to class? No. Oh, my pain. Oh, the pain. We're almost there. I can see it. Of course you can. It's right fucking there. I should be coy or some shit. I don't know. Sorry. I know it's taking longer than I thought. But look on the bright side. The bright side is giving me sunburn. You could consider this to be part of the whole poetic experience. I could have turned back if I knew where I was. Yeah, that would, that would make sense. Why am I on a date with this guy? Well... Now you don't have to because we're here. Finally. It is beautiful. Almost worthy of taking a picture. I, I got a camera. Do it. Do it. Great call. Let's get one together. Then take as many other snaps as you want. I like to take war pictures of people that look like meat after being run over by tanks. How about you, Seth? So, Seth. How's the poetry? Can I see? Just one little look? I promise not to judge. I think it is time we go our separate ways now. It has been an action-packed day, and I think I should like to lie down a spell while I digest it all. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. But... Hi. Could you use some help with your flowers? I do need someone to help me plant the flower beds near the fountain. If you're interested. Yeah, sure. I've got some extra time. This is someone's fetish. Someone dreams about this part of the game. They say, oh my god, the flower planting. Did you see the flower planting? So hot. Also, I'm an artist. You did a really nice job. Here's a small thank you for your hard work. Here's some visine for your wide eyes. Ooh, a textbook. <laughs> <laughs> oh, of course you, you need to go to school for fine textbooks. Where would you go? And another textbook. Hmm. Hi, Izzy. Izzy, I'd like to shoot some hoops or shoot some hoops. Wait, why are there two hoop shootings? Do I have to do them both? Come back here. I have questions. FB, what? Um... All right, mysterious symbols. 
Oh, it was a QTE. Press X not to die. Got it. Let's try that again. We'll try it again. Yep. Okay. Press buttons. Got it. Down. Left. Huzzah! It's the safety pads. They give me power. Someone needs to sign this girl to a contract. Thanks. My dad used to play in high school, and he started teaching me when I was little. Smart guy. Sport provides a lot of avenues for kids. Whoa, lots of avenues. You don't usually hear those words coming out of a jock's mouth. Yeah, well, my vocabulary consists of more than four-letter words. Impressive. So, are you going to try out for the team or what? This feels racist. So, I'll become sexist. You mean the boys' team, right? Because there would be no challenge playing against the girls. You haven't played against them yet, so you have no idea. Plus, we've never had a girl on the boys' squad before. And back in the day, women weren't allowed to vote. And in some countries, they still can't. Not in this one. I like your attitude. We could use some of that on the team. What the shit is going on? Are we bantering? What the fuck? Alright, well, I guess that'll never come up again. We need to get out of here. This is Chuck Majors. He's now on our contacts list. I don't care. Meanwhile, garbage. And more garbage. Even more garbage. So much garbage. The last of the garbage. Yeah, that was the thing. Now all I need to do is talk to the ranger and turn in this uh, quest. Quest? Quest. It's a quest. Wow! You finished already? Absolutely. The park is so clean you could eat off the ground. <laughs> I wouldn't. I've seen what animals do on the ground. Still, I can't thank you enough. Here. Take this fridge magnet I found. Thanks! I don't have this one. Is this a reference or something? To like, blood or cum on the grass? Oh, okay. Now, now I'm, I'm done with the sleepovers. Ah, uh, sure, Abigail, whatever. Still have a message? Oh, there's a there's a huge sale in the mall. Hi, how are you today? I have just murdered several people and I'd like to confess. Also, I brought this baby head for good measure. I'm here to pick up an item. Of course. It's right over there. Have a nice day. Thanks. You know what this mall needs is like a Spencer's or a Hot Topic, which I guess is like as a fish. Or no, no, they don't sell mugs and adds a fish. Thanks for shopping at Jeans. Customers are reminded that the mall closes at 10 p.m. Thank you for your patronage. Your mom's a patronage. Let's just fast forward a little bit to the next school day. Can you spot me in the crowd? Here I am. <laughs> If I'm to take this game as canon, I'm pretty sure date could mean, like, just going out and talking to the person for five seconds, maybe ten seconds. Alright, we got a message. It is from... Oh, uh... Okay, let's talk about some guy. Hi there, here's your top. Thanks. I owe you one. I don't know what I'd do without this. Probably be more popular. What? I said, I love how happy you are. Was that a cut down? I'm not sure. Oh well, she seems happy, so okay. Uh, let's see, that's one more objective down. Awesome. Ooh. Sure. Magnet. Why not? All right, I'm gonna show you guys the, the dark secret of this school. There's a wall over here. There's a wall over here. There's no way out of the school. What took so long? I thought you'd be dying to go. 
Shenanigans. Sorry about that. I had some things to take care of. It's okay. Let's get going. I'm just gonna cut out all loading screens. Okay. So, tell me about this Chuck Majors dude. You mean he hasn't told you everything about him already? No. He's told me quite a bit. But it feels like he's holding some stuff back. Chuck Majors? He's a really nice guy and all, but... But... He's a little bit awkward socially. Really? He didn't seem like that to me. Well, what did you guys talk about? Basketball. Well, there you go. Get a girl talking about shopping, and we can talk for hours. Same thing there. Try talking about something other than that, and see where it gets you. I'll have to pay attention to that. One thing I was wondering is, if he's the star of the team, why doesn't he have a girlfriend? Ah, he hasn't gotten to that part yet, huh? He was going out with Chelsea Harper, but they, uh... Let's just say Chuck's a little awkward around girls. Emily, you're so bad. <laughs> right. That's not the point. So, Chuck spends all of his time practicing, right? I mean, you can tell the boy is dedicated. Chelsea didn't like that, so she gave him an ultimatum. Basketball? Or her? Yep, and he chose basketball. How embarrassing. Why would he do that? She was probably smothering him. You guys don't like that. They need their space, and I guess Chuck got tired of it. To tell the truth, I would have done the same thing if some boy was stopping me from shopping. So, he's available then? That's the moral of the story. Don't fall into the same trap she did, though. What? The smothering? That too. But no, Chelsea couldn't even remember what his favorite soda was. She would always order the wrong thing. What's his favorite? Fizzy Berry Lemonade. No joke. This guy is everything a jock isn't. You sure there's more you're not telling me? I've told you all I got. Okay. Thanks. This still feels like stereotyping. If you haven't noticed now, when it comes to boys in this game, Emily is the guidebook. She gives you hints on what you're supposed to do. Explaining that... Uh, oh, uh, Emily, hold still. There we go. Explaining that, for example, PD is, um, PD is not self-assured. Why can't I pick this fucking magnet up? Okay, moving on. Uh, also, Chuck Majors, there's more to him than just being a jock, which, again, feels a little like racism to me, only stereotyping, I guess. Like, all sports jocks can't... Yeah, let's shoot, hey. shoot some hoops. Hey, hey there. All right, good, uh, good hoop shooting. There, I guess. Okay, this happened while I was wandering around the park. Hello? Today. Anyone there? Recognize that voice? I'm stuck in the maze. Help! Help! I'm lost. Yep. Hello? Anyone there? Here we go. I'm stuck in the maze. Alright there, Bruce Campbell. Say fuzzy pickles. Help! Help! I'm lost! You're telling me, buddy. Let's see here. Just hold still, Chuck. Yeah, no thank you, Seth. It's not Hello? a good photo of anyone Emily. there? Perfect. I'm glad you found me. I wasn't scared or anything, I just wanted uh, someone to talk to. Sure you did. It's okay to be scared, you know. Chuck Majors does not get scared, especially by some stupid maze. No, but Chuck Majors is still talking like that, and that scares me. I did? Yep. See? I don't even know when I'm doing it. Don't know when you're doing what? What are we talking about? I feel like an idiot getting lost in that maze. You are an idiot, but we're too nice for our own good. Hey, Izzy. And yeah, we'll be quiet. I won't tell anyone, I swear. Good. Because if you did, I'd just deny it. Except that everyone heard you screaming for help. <laughs> Got you there, buddy. Okay, 
we have to go through all these conversations. I don't want to because I'm not interested in Chuck Majors, but here we are. Let's start... Let's start with so, Lost. So, tell me how you got lost in the maze, because I just don't get it. I was remembering highlight number 16. In your head? Right. That's so weird. Go ahead. Right. So, in highlight number 16, I drove to the hoop on this one guy and did a perfect layout. We've got a big game coming up, and I wanted to use the same move at some point. Yes. There's a big game coming up? Yeah, there's a big game. It's our homecoming against our crosstown rivals. I guess that is a big deal. And not only that, but my dad says that scouts are going to be there. Scouts? What, like for the army? So the mall is cool. I've never been in one I didn't like. But what else is cool to do around here? I don't know. There's a bunch of restaurants to choose from. A movie theater. You like movies, right? I do. I can't go to the movies and not get popcorn. Even though it's so expensive? Sometimes I go to the theater for just popcorn and don't see a movie. That's dedication. Most people probably hang out at the mall, right? Yeah, there's pretty much everything there. Oh, there's this really sweet gelato place. You'd love it. Yeah, sure. I, I love gelato. Gelato? You're talking to the wrong person. I am a gelato fiend. You don't like it more than me. I guarantee that. Let me take you to the gelateria for saving my life. I will suck the piss out of your dick for some gelato. I couldn't be a gelato fiend and turn it down, now could I? Didn't think you would. I was just testing you. So no gelato? Oh, we're definitely going. Ah, oh, shit, he's falling in love with me. Can I get out of this now? Uh, se secret. Don't worry. I'll keep it a secret. You swear? Yeah. That's one of the things I'm good at. I don't know. People have let me down before. Can you imagine talking to this guy while waiting to pick up Petey? Want to talk about it? Not really. I mean, I do, but just not now. It takes a lot to gain Chuck Major's trust. So I see. What, like a knife or something? I, yeah, I guess. I'm I completely sure. understand. You do? Yeah, I'm new here. You hardly know me, and I'm a girl. We love to gossip. Thanks. Most people would have interrogated me. You're lucky I left my interrogation kit in my locker. But really, it's no problem. You'll see that you can trust me. I have interrogation electrodes for it. All right, so aside from this jock-eating maze, what else do you do in this park? Whatever you want. There's a skate park. If you like photography, there's a ton of nature shots for you. It's just a good place to hang out. You do any of that stuff? No. But it's nice to know I can. That's the one thing about jocks is... Apparently they're all idiots? Again, if I take what this game is showing as canon, all girls are just blathering gossipers and all boys are... Projects. Anyway. There's a well here. What else can we wish for? I wish I could find a million dollars stuffed in a garbage can. There's probably a million dollars stuffed in that, uh, well. Ooh, another sale today! My dreams have come true! So, this is all the magnets we got. Now, I can't help but notice that for some reason, Petey's magnet is tiny. I don't like that. But, uh, I do have all of these magnets, and something kind of funny and kind of shows off I don't know what they did with the programming to make this happen I now have so many magnets that whenever they push into each other it starts to lag the frame rate look at this this is not fraps doing this this is the game I tried this without fraps running same problem it was just <laughs> collision meanwhile on the next day I I don't remember what comes up next. Oh god, what am I doing with my life or anything else? Oh well, fuck it. Let's talk to Petey. By talk to, by talk to Petey, I mean, uh, read a message. Good for you. Yes. Let's get some 
Franco. Man, Petey's into this. Busting out Buster Keaton. I'm Star. I'd do anything for a candy bar. Can you do this? Like what? Like, ask you to find me one? That's not too desperate. But okay. Fetch Quest! Uh, uh... Here. I got you a gift. It's not a gift. You son of a bitch! You're gonna take my fucking gift or- Let's try this again with the left option. Hmm. I don't remember getting that. The Candy Bar Express is here! Great! I was getting the shakes. You might get those after this. It's made with super sugar. Able to cause diabetes in a single bound. It's super sugar. What's the best thing in the school's cafeteria? The exit. Hey, what's up? <laughs> you don't look so good. I'm just bugging about the battle that's coming up. I don't feel like I'm ready at all. You're ready, dude. We're behind you 80% of the way. That nothing you're working on sounds pretty sick. Thanks. God damn it, Petey. You're a hard man to love. Uh, I, I don't know. Books? Wait. There's a book here. Uh, where am I going? I had to speed this up because this took forever. Where am I going? Oh, of, of course. Why wouldn't it be there? I guess I just knew about it through the wall. If I'm right, this is the last of the textbooks, which means we can turn this quest in. Hello, Miss Trimble. I take it you found my books. Sure did. Thank you. You are dismissed. Do I get, like, money for this or some shit? I don't think I do. It's kind of not fair. Hey, you look upset. What's wrong? I lost my wife's birthday present. Will you help me find it? Holy shit, it's one of the Beatles. Yeah! Absolutely! Thanks for helping me. It, it's a purple bag. I'm sure it's in the mall somewhere. Huh. Huh. It's probably next to the gelato. Oh, Ooh, a fridge magnet. And I was right, purple bag. Like I've played this before. Alright, get, get in close. Kiss. Come on, get him real close. Be one with him. Yeah. Look what I found. Excellent. I can't believe you found my... I mean, my wife's gift. Thank you very much. The world's a better place. Hooray! Uh, yeah, I did this quest. Let's see, we got a message from... Uh... Okay. It's getting very close to time to close. I gotta rush. I gotta rush. Oh my god. Oh my god, the seconds are ticking by. Will I be able to make it? Jesus! Jesus! Let me know if you have any questions. Alright. Made it in time. Now, the mall won't close while you're in a shop. Uh, I figured I might sh might as well show you guys. I can't remember if I've, I've done this or not because it's been so long. God, how long have I been playing this game? This is how you try on clothes before you buy them. Uh, unnecessary arrangement, I understand, but um, this is also the only way you can remove clothes from your shopping basket. So if you don't like something, you have to pick another, like, say I didn't like that shirt. I'd have to put on another shirt in order to throw that shirt away out of the shopping bag. There is no other option like this. I guess you could uncheck it. Supposedly. That's a great choice. Thinking about it, I'm not sure what'll happen if I just, um... Have a good one. Walk out without paying for something. I 
do try that. The time is now 10 p.m. and the mall is closing. Have a nice day. All in all, a pretty uneventful uh, day. Uh, message? What? Um. Yes, I I got it, Emily. Thank thank you for all of your help. Hmm. Let's send Petey a message. I gotta keep him on a leash, you know. Mom won't let me sneak out anymore. Not, not since the incident. How are you, Petey? Waiting, 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 and all of them will die. Hooray! Wait a second. Is that Olivia? Olivia sent me the exact same message. Is, is Petey cheating on me?